excited, Rev? They should go a couple. Excited to go racing? What? You excited to go racing? Yeah, I'm super excited. Uh, but I'm actually more excited to play this game right now. To play Smash Land. Oh my, oh my god, I love it. How so much cool. did you spend more than 200 yet? No. I'm at 200 still. 200 still, that's yeah, good. Yeah, 200, but it's awesome. <laughs> Pat, you excited to go on the no. racing? No, yeah. you're not? Yeah, you <clears throat> learn how to drive stick. Oh, dude, that's all right. That's all right. No. You'll learn. Just arrived at the racetrack. So it's, it's pretty sweet. It's pretty sweet. Nope. Oh. Okay. Can I wait? Got the bikes, look at the old car. These are the BMWs that we'll be driving. Drive car, right? that's yeah, these are the BMWs we'll be driving. Ben, you gonna have to drive the Yeah, that's my car though, right there, right there. That's my car. I found your car. Should be freaking sweet. That's where we learn how to properly drive and whatnot. Learn some things, I guess. Safety rules and whatnot. <laughs> Everyone's pretty excited. Or if we change the passenger by the starting Helmets and stuff for the bike. Ground floor in the tower building. For the NASCAR ride, you take your balak. This is a track we'll be racing on here. Pretty interesting, pretty excited. We'll have the GoPro footage of it. Do a NASCAR first on the passenger, then we'll do we'll be doing bikes, then we'll get to drive those BMWs I showed you at the beginning. Oh my god. It's probably subtle, but it's I think those are the NASCARs we'll be riding in. Not driving, but riding in maybe. What do we need to put on to get in the NASCAR? Excited, Tim? You excited? Scared? <laughs> so what you guys just saw there was Tim getting dressed in these race suits that you had to wear if you're gonna ride that motorcycle that goes insanely fast around the track. Um, half of about half of us decided to ride on that, and the other half didn't. Um, the other half got to ride in the NASCAR while we did the motorbike, which was definitely the more scary option. Though, but I'll have some GoPro footage of that. Uh, the first driver you're gonna see is Tim riding on the track, and then you're gonna see me hop on. And uh, it was pretty crazy. Just listen to the bike and look how fast we're going. It's pretty sweet, guys. So this is now us driving the M3s. <laughs> this was probably the funnest part of the day for sure because I don't know, I love driving manuals. I used to own a Mitsubishi Eclipse so right now I currently don't have a manual and it really, this we're driving these really made me miss it and want to get one for my next car but yeah so this is just our first practice laps um, because while some of us were driving around the track, I think some other ones like people that didn't know how to drive manuals or anything like that, they were driving. Uh, practicing like the parking lot and stuff 
But yeah, so this is the practice laps, and then later on we do have some of the we have the races from like the time trials we put got put in pools and stuff. But I don't know, that motorbike was just literally crazy. It was like literally insane. Definitely the most adrenaline packed thing that we did during today. But this was driving them through is definitely the most fun. Um, this is just the kind of the overlook of the track. It doesn't sound too bad uh, with the GoPro on right now, but I know some of the race to like race clips from the GoPro footage uh, sounds pretty crappy because the GoPro casing is like kind of soundproof and protects the GoPro, but so you can't really hear the car too bad or too well, I should say. Um, this next little clip that I will show you guys is actually of my phone when I was not racing or driving on the track, and I wanted to show you, capture you what it, what it sounded like on the outside from the car, like right here, what it sounds like going down the track. So that's pretty sweet right there. And then the next clip will be someone actually driving down the main drag right there where you can get the most top speed. You can see the GoPro does not sound very well, so I'm probably going to mute that out. Yeah, this is the last turn here. And then you get the home free, home stretch right here. You go as fast as you can. This is where you gunned it. This is where you went over definitely over 100 miles an hour. It was pretty crazy. I don't really know what it is in kilometers, but yeah, um, myself and Tim were in number 33. You can see it was, I don't know, I don't remember if that was me or him who passed this guy right here that has the GoPro on, but yeah, Tim is the community manager for Boom Beach and myself were in race car number 33 the whole time because we just switched off whenever one of us were not driving. So it was pretty sweet. And <laughs> this next clip is some of what uh, I think Lori, the he was the guy that director for the the class live stream and this is him spinning out um, I'm pretty sure at least like everyone spun out at least once um, maybe there was a couple people that didn't but he did a full 360 here even I spun out once but it was really early on um, I actually spun out on the same kind of turn up here it's just farther up down the track and it's actually really fun spinning out not gonna lie um, but this next clip I don't even really remember what it is all right this is when we got placed into pools this wasn't my pool um, this was uh, the other pool and I was standing on the sideline so I wanted to take a video of it just to show you the start off and then the next clip will be the GoPro footage. Oh, Galadon's getting that rolling start. This is Tim's race with Galadon and Tim pulls it out though so it's pretty sweet because he was, he was number two right now. And then we'll see the, uh, the pass coming up right here, well the start and the pass. So you can see 33. Mine, well, not my car, but Tim is in there now. You can see the start out. Got the back GoPro footage that looks pretty sweet. And then later on, Tim will overtake Galadon, and then he'll end up holding on the lead for the win. So if you saw it early on, the cards were kind of sliding on the end. That's because you guys are giving it all because you do not want to lose in the finals. But I'm going to slow you down and point your direction on this final turn here. Look top right, top right of your screen, top right of your screen, top right of your screen. See right there, see that car? That's where reversal actually ended up. And the first time I saw that, dude, I was dying. But yeah, right there, that's where Tim passed Galadon and he held on for the win. This is the group photo, a group photo of all of us when we had our little race gear on. Um, do you see the jacket? How some people are just wearing like those blue and white things. Those are the uh, jackets that we had to wear inside the cars, but those special suits we had to wear, wear for the race bikes. And then next up, this is uh, just me inside the car. Um, don't really know like the face there, but dude, the M3s are definitely fun. And then the ending clips here are, have, are actually when I was actually at the racetrack and everything like that. Um, talk about some things, talk about reversals, crash, and whatnot. But yeah, so that's gonna wrap it up for my talking here, and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Just got done racing. Uh, we did time trials, and we kind of like had Group A for fastest and Group B. I was putting Group B, won the race for Group B, but Tim, Tim won for, for Group A. Let's see if we can find him. Oh, I have it on my phone. Hey Tim. Hey Tim, how's it feel to be the winner? Thanks, <laughs> Mom.
So this clip right here is after they retrieved the crest car that reversal did, it had some damage. Um, some of the metal you can see down in there is shredded out. The front bumper is kind of destroyed. And then there's another dent in on the right hand side. And I think one of the wheels was kind of like crooked a little bit, but yeah, so that's the car that reversal actually ended up crashing. These hurt. I found we're in that stupid suit. Now we're in that super suit. <laughs> yeah. Can't diamond everything. <laughs> <laughs> I need to plug that middle part. Yeah. <laughs> Just about to leave the racetrack at the Heyday restaurant. See the tractor. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, we're just at some random restaurant that got a lot of farming stuff in it. Um, home back from one of the coolest days ever of racing. So, made it back to the hotel. Today was probably the funnest day since we had here doing the, we rode that speed bike. That was ridiculous. That was probably the most adrenaline packed thing I've ever done in my life. Um, then we got to drive those BMW M3s around the track and that was ridiculous, guys. Um, <clears throat> so fun, um, I haven't drawn a, a manual car since I had my Mitsubishi Eclipse, which is about a year ago. And driving that car makes me want to get another manual because right now I have a G5 Cobalt or slash cobalt um, with or G5 with cobalt parts as you saw probably in my day in the life video but driving that again driving fast um, I only spun out once which was actually really good compared to other people um, unfortunately reversal did kind of like have the, not the best of luck but he's never driven a car before so he wasn't doing too bad I did not have an outro clip made for this video but yeah guys like I said this was definitely one of the coolest days at Supercell. I am back at home now. Um, I had to upload this later because the GoPro footage we had to get like downloaded and I couldn't download it until I was back at home. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It was definitely pretty sweet. I hope you guys, I think I have one more video from Finland. I think it was my trip home. If you guys want to see that, let me know because um, I can definitely upload that, but I'm not sure. Uh, pretty much up to you guys if you want to see that or not. It's pretty much just like my last day there, flying home and arriving back at home. So if you guys want to see that, let me know. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure that you did. And don't forget to subscribe for more Boom Rage videos if you're not ready. I hope you guys have a wonderful day or night. And I'll see you guys later.